Hey guys, this is the end of the stitch down Thunderdome. Um, the patina contest. This I contest with these snakes, overlanders. Um, the leather is tan smooth, and with the overlander have this elastic toe, eight inches tall, with the lock sole, double stitching. And just want to show you what is the end of my of the row in this contest with this boot. I have a video um, in my channel how they look on the <laughs> before the first day of wearing them, and now. You can see guys, well, I have some missing leather here. Um, normally I wear these boots with jeans and the jeans will cover most of my upper as well as part of the, uh, of the corner heel. So I don't hit too much this, uh, all this area, but definitely you will find that I need a lot and sometimes I'm on the floor. So mostly this is the part where I'm, where, where I get the, the more abrasions. Um, this stain, I'm gonna try to clean these boots and see if, if the stains will will go away. I don't think this one, this is like paint, but these ones you can see here, a lot of scuffings. This leather, absolutely, I love this leather because even with all this scuff, it doesn't look that bad. So I'm glad that I chose this one, the, the Sado 10 Smooth. You can watch here how my, how the toe, man, how the toe is, uh, it's just the band. This from, this was hitting a lot, it was hit a lot. It can be worse, but uh, believe it or not, I take care more or less of my boots. I try to always uh, stand in good position, in good position, sorry. Um, I'm not there trying to destroy them. Uh, even working, try to I try to 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 make them last, right? The midsole, uh, I think I one or two times I, I put the the tint, the paint brown from Fiblins, and well already fade away with water. Um, here I made a mistake. I was cutting uh, with, with with a machete and I miss uh, the cut. And I mean, thinking if I should should put some stitches here, it's not super deep. Well, it is. It's quite deep, but not 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 enough to to pass through the leather. That is why. I like to use Nyx work leathers. It's a uh, seven eight uh, ounces thick because of this. Uh, even with this big, uh, with this big cut, and the boot stands very well, flexing and everything. You can see here the creasing. This is a well. This is a well, a very well uh, used boot. Um, I love how it turned with the oven. I got a video with when I put oven of oil is the only one well, I only only one time I put oil on these boots and I think the other time a very very light wax uh, I don't remember the brand it's auto something like that a very very light one just to instead of cream I put a little wax to help uh, with the water and that's it nothing else the first month or two I use paracord laces because it helps a lot molding your foot and breaking the boot. So, and I can take care of the leather laces. I don't break them. You can tie very well the boot the first one or two months. And then I change it to, to the NYX uh, black, black leather laces. I really, really like how these boots turn out. They finish like champions. I'm not sure if I want to win or not, but this was a very fun contest. Uh, this is mostly paint and maybe caulking. Uh, I don't remember very well. Believe it or not, before coming home, I tried to, with a cloth with water, I tried to clean my boots a little bit. I don't like to come and having all the, the dust and sewer that I've been walking in inside of the house so this is increasing very very good 
just so you guys can check the leather. It's a beautiful leather. If you take care of this, if you, if, I think I can use this leather as as casual. It's very very nice. It's, it's a very very great leather. I like. At the beginning, it was very natural and looks kind of strange for me. But now with the patina and the oil, it has turned some light brown and is beautiful. It's just beautiful. Um, the lock soles. This uh, I think I have I have more comfort with the lock soles. I think the it has some cushion while, while walking. It's different walking with the locks instead of the flat soles like the V bar and the mini. It's different in the walking, a little more robust, but definitely at the long run I feel more comfortable with the locks. Have have more cushion and help you during the day. Um, Definitely guys a, a beautiful pair to I'm very proud um, To be using at least five five days of the way working. I have another pair here the Latigo This is uh, almost the same just soft toe. This is a Latigo and Well, I really like this one uh, I've been using this very casually already already start breaking the the ankle So it's going there. It's going there. It's it's still stiff this is not this is not a stiff leather it's just it's a thick material see because it's thick it, it takes time to to it, it takes some time uh to to break it have some waxes mostly it's oils and waxes so the work leathers have mostly oils and this this leather have waxes and oil so the wax uh, it, it get it get you some trouble because the consistency is stiff, it's firm, it will give you some trouble to, to, to break them. But you can see here how is the, I still have the original, the original edge color, the leather. Well, not much heating, it's not much scuffing, it's, it's, like, it's almost new. I've been using this uh, now uh, a few days and well, there you go. You can see here the wearing, more wearing with this one. Not that much, but this locks, it really lasts long. I like this. I like this, this type of, of soles because it lasts very long. Um, I do a lot of rotation, so it, help, it helps. Latigo, the pull out, it's amazing. It's, a st it's firm. Not like the horse run, but it's firm. You can, if this is leather, it's not for everyone. Um, Latigo is quite, quite stiff. And not too many people like it, but I really like it. I really love it. Look, let me do the pinch. The pinch test. There you go. <laughs> it's thick. This thing is thick. This one is more supply. Even if you have almost the same thickness. It's a lot more supply now, already break. This one gets me <laughs> really time to, it's smart stuff. But well, there you go guys. This is Latigo uh, by NYX. Overlander soft toe. I like the soft toe for casual. Uh, the elastic, I don't feel this elastic too much. Just a little bit and it's really nice for working or if you want to protect your, your feet a little bit more. Uh, I really suggest use elastics. Soft toe, I like it uh, doing casually because you don't feel. I feel just a little bit on the on the sides, just a little, nothing wrong. But uh, while working, I love the elastic. When going out with the family, walking, and not doing too many work, I like more the soft toe. But anyways, I can take these ones to my first pair of knee, the chocolate are soft toe, and I still still beating the hell out. So. It's pretty good, pretty good material. Well, guys, this is just a just a video of these two beautiful leathers, and especially the how I finish with the with the Thunderdome. Hope um, hope you liked it. Hope you like it, and well, thank you, guys. See you later.